The Neighborhood Development Division is preparing their annual action plan for CDBG funding. Annual action plan is part of the process that we have to go through to continue to receive our entitlement money from HUD, which is the um, U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development. Every year we have to do two specific reports for them. One is the annual action plan and the other is the consolidated action report that we call the CAPER. These funds have helped many people throughout our community, from seniors and veterans to at-risk youth and first-time home buyers. Most of the time people think of the CDBG program here in our community as just doing housing. Over the past five years, we have done about 19 housing projects. Six of those housing projects were complete rehabs of a, a structure, and the rest of the projects, the 13, were complete rebuilds. So these were new homes that were built with the funding. We've also, also done infrastructure projects, like the new South Troop Street location, where we did all the sidewalks and the piping and, and all of that. That was done with a conjunction of SPLOS money and different community pots of money, but CDBG also contributed to that project. We've also done, um, this year was our inaugural year for our Great Promise Partnership program, which with the city school system and the Great Promise program, we brought on board 20 students to work within the city. The city is looking for citizens' input to help with the annual action plan. If you're unable to come in to our location or to su submit your, um, your comments to us directly, you can go on our website and put your comments about what we're planning on doing with the funding for our annual action plan. And we just ask citizens to participate and to be vocal because if we're not, chances are there's a good chance that we may not have this funding in the future and this is vital to our community. For more information, contact Neighborhood Development or visit the city's website.